Hi everyone, thanks for joining me. I'm Allison and I'm the Archival Specialist at the Northside Neighborhood History Collection at Chicago Public Library's Solzer Regional Library. Today we're going to explore an archival collection that I was inspired to select by this year's One Book, One Chicago selection, which is Exit West by Mohsin Hamid. If you haven't already, I would encourage you to pick up a selection at a branch near you and read along with us this fall. Storytelling and travel beyond borders are two themes in Exit West. And if you'd like to explore those ideas in the archives, the Esther Barlow collection is a great place to start. Esther Barlow was a children's librarian at the Chicago Public Library for almost 50 years, from 1927 to 1976. And she is most fondly remembered for her work as a storyteller and for the story hours she held with generations of Northside children. Esther Barlow was a second generation immigrant whose parents were born in Norway. Esther herself was born in Minnesota in 1904, and her family moved when she was quite young to a small town in Iowa where she grew up with her sister, Palma. Esther graduated from Lake Forest College in 1927, and she was hired by Chicago Public Library that same year. In her first few years at CPL, Esther Barlow served at several different Northside branches, where one of her duties was telling story hours in Wells Park which is right across the street from where Salzer Library is located today. After her first few years on the job in 1942, she moved to the Lakeview branch, where she stayed until 1955. In 1955, she was appointed head of the children's department at Hild Regional Library. She remained at Hild Library until 1976 when she retired. Looking through the collection shows that Esther Barlow's interest in storytelling started early in her career. In 1930, she took a class on storytelling where she noted some interesting advice. One piece of advice was to strike a chord that will attract attention at once, avoid long introductions. And another was to never tell a story that you do not like or half know. She continued to take classes for many years and filled pages with notes on storytelling and children's librarianship. We also have some of her planning materials, such as a notebook from the 1960s, where she recorded the stories she told and attendance at programs. Her planning documents also include activity cards, which look like they contain the text of rhymes and songs that she led the children who attended her programs in. The collection also contains a selection of Esther Barlow's children's books, ranging from this 1896 edition of Helen Jackson's Complete Poems to A Time for Trolls, Fairy Tales from Norway, and Everything Known in Music, which has great illustrations. We can carefully flip through the books and cards and imagine what it must have been like for Esther to share them with the children who gathered to hear her speak, or consider what it was like for the children who listened to her stories and were temporarily transported to a different time and place. Today, Esther is remembered at Solzer Regional Library through a storytelling room named in her honor, where in normal times, children continue to gather to hear stories. Researchers are welcome to explore the Esther Barlow collection at the Northside Neighborhood History Collection. We encourage anyone who is interested in visiting or sharing stories to contact us at northsidehistory at chipublive.org. Currently, you do need an appointment to visit, but we love welcoming people to the archives. We hope to see you soon.